Daytona Beach City Commissioners have turned down a proposal for a new temporary homeless shelter. Now the people staying at the current temporary shelter have less than a week before it closes. Tonight, Volusia County leaders are talking about a proposal for a more permanent situation. News 6 reporter Lauren Korn joins us from Daytona Beach ahead of tonight's public meeting. City leaders have been discussing for the last half hour other options for a temporary shelter after the original plan was turned down. What they were going to do for the homeless, I thought, I thought it was a wonderful thing. But now Sandy and dozens of others will be forced out of Salvation Army come Tuesday and back onto the streets. I don't know what I'm going to do next. After the plan of housing the homeless temporarily at the Armed Forces Reserve Center fell through, you can see the city already started minimal renovations. It's not being used at all. I thought that would be a great thing. To our thinking, it was um, a place that offered the best um, opportunity for us to get things done as quickly as we could. But the commission voted against the nine month plan after some residents argued about the location, safety and property value. The points they made were points that anyone would make that's concerned about property that they own. So it's back to the drawing board. There aren't any specific locations necessarily, but we do have some that we are exploring options on looking into further, uh, obviously getting uh, dimensions and uh, looking at plans to see what those buildings would cost in renovations. And if the city does and act fast. We're going to have uh, the possibility of people being released from the Salvation Army literally with no place to go. That's something that I think all of us are concerned about. In Daytona Beach, Lauren Korn, News 6. And city leaders hope to have a new plan before Tuesday, but the city commissioners will ultimately have the final say on where the temporary location will be.